How to make captions like this on your phone or laptop? I'll show you right now. First of all, let's look at the result we will get. You can make hundreds of dollars with your phone just by doing captions like this. For example, I was found a customer who needed to cut his vertical video and add captions. The hourly rate was $10 and the customer paid $170 for 17 hours. But the interesting thing is that this work can be done with the phone. Install the CapCut app on your phone and let's get started. And later in this video, I'll show you how to do it on the laptop. First, you need to create a new project. Select the videos you need, go to the workspace, open the text item or the captions. Here you can choose the language you speak in the video. I'm leaving it in English. Turn on Identify Invalid Clips, which will detect pauses in the video so you can quickly delay them later. Start creating captions. You won't have to wait long, it all happens in a matter of seconds. In ready-made captions, select the All Pauses, press Delete, Confirm, that's it, all the pauses in the video have been removed. This is an easy way to save your time. Now you need to edit the generated captions. Press Batch Edit. Some phrases are very long, they need to be divided. Select the phrase, place the cursor where the division will be and press the indent. Captions are automatically divided. Try to leave two or three words in each caption. You can leave more words if necessary. Some captions I make with one word on which I want to put emphasis. Let's move on to the design of the captions. Select the style item. In the font sections, you can choose one of the basic fonts or add your own. I downloaded the bold font from dafon.com. It's 100% free to use and does not require licenses. In CapCut, click on Add Font, Upload File, find the downloaded font on your phone and add it to the program. Then select the downloaded font. It changes immediately in the captions created before. Now let's move on to the Style tab. For captions, I use white, yellow and green colors. Set the text size to 20. After that, select the glow item. Set the black color, intensity 65, range 55. Now click on the check mark at the top of this menu. And the basic style for these captions is ready. In the style menu, turn off apply to auto captions. Now we can edit each caption separately. First, you can play with the size and position of the captions. Short captions can be increased in size. Some captions can be lowered or raised. You can also add rotation to some captions. In some phrases, accents need to be made on the main words. To do this, select the captions, highlight the desired word, change the color and increase the size by 2-4 points. Repeat this with other captions. After that, we can start creating animations for the text. Select the title, go to the animation menu and choose the animation you need. At this point, I will add the standard zoom out animation, which will add dynamics at the very beginning of the video. You can do the same with some other titles. Don't be afraid to experiment with different animations. For example, beside the zoom out animation, I also add a loop animation called jiggle. You can design the whole video like this and get a great result. But now I will show you a few more useful features. Now I want to repeat this animation. To get this result, you need to perform a few simple actions. Click on the required title, turn on the video, hundreds of at the end of the first line, pause and split the titles using the split button. Highlight the first cut part, highlight the first line, change the color to green or yellow, increase the size by 4 points, repeat all of this with the next line, we get this result. Hundreds of dollars with your phone. To make the result even better, I will add emojis to this title. You can use basic stickers that are already in CapCut. Or add your own. I download emojis from emojipedia.org. There are many free emojis that you can quickly find and download to your phone. Click on the stickers, then click on this button and select the required image. On the screen, adjust the size and placement of the emoji. On the timeline, set when it should appear and when it should disappear. Also, add a loop animation called scroll left. And now the emoji flies through the frame. You can also try different animation options. The main thing is to make the animation fast. Repeat the process on the other titles in the video. In addition to emojis, you can add any other images. This can be simple photos or screenshots. It doesn't matter. The main thing is that they match the content of the video. All titles are ready. Now let's move on to an equally important part, sound effects. Sounds add atmosphere and dynamics to the video. CapCut has a good collection of sound effects. You can use the search to find what you need and add sounds to your favorites. For this video, I choose several sounds. At times when an emoji appears on the screen, we can add a swoosh effect. Add it to the timeline, place it at the beginning of animation and change the volume to 20, 30 and here's the result. You can make hundreds of dollars.
can make hundreds of dollars. You can also add your sounds to the video. For this, I downloaded a free cash register sound from pixabay.com. To add it, go to sounds, select the folder icon and choose from the device. From the list, take the downloaded sound and click on the plus sign next to the sound. Place the sound on the timeline and change the volume to 30. Listen, was $10 and great. Next, place the sounds without the video. You can add various types of sounds, pop, ding, swoosh, all of this improves your video. The main thing is not to overdo it. And that's it, the video is ready, export it and you can post it on social networks. As you can see, this can be done easily and quickly on your phone using the functions I have shown. The most important thing here is to show your creativity and you will succeed. But if you prefer to use computer, here's how you can make these captions on it. Create a new project, import the videos, sounds and images you need. It's not necessary to add everything at once. You can add new files at any time if you need it. Drag the video onto the timeline, click the text button, auto captions, choose your language and click create. Your captions have appeared on the timeline. You can identify parts of the video with pauses by looking at the captions track. Cut them using the split tool or use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus B or Command plus B. Right click on the frames with pauses and delete them. You can also use the backspace key for this. Proceed to the captions. Left click on the caption, select captions. Some phrases are very long and they need to be split. Place the cursor where the split will be and press enter. The captions are automatically split. Try to leave 2 or 3 words in each caption, but you can leave more words if needed. Now go to the text tab, choose the font for the captions. You can choose a font from the basic CapCut presets or one of the system fonts. I downloaded the bold font from dafont.com. It's 100% free to use and doesn't require any licenses. Choose the bold font. Set the text size to 20, choose a style preset with white text and a black outline, we use white as the base color and later in the video we will need yellow and green colors. Enable the shadow, the basic shadow settings work for us. In the text menu turn off apply to all, so we can edit each caption individually. And the changes will not affect other captions. So now we are editing each caption individually. Adjust the size and position of the captions. This can be done in the position and size menu in the text tab or you can move the captions directly in the player with the cursor. You can enlarge short captions, so captions can be lowered or raised. You can also add rotation to some captions, I recommend choosing values within minus 3 to 3 degrees. In some captions you can highlight keywords with a different color. To do this, select the caption, highlight the desired word, change the color and increase the size by 4 points. Repeat with other captions. Let's move on to animations. Here we have in, out, and loop animations. In animations are animations for the appearance of an object on the screen. Out animations are for the object's exit. Loop animations are mostly looped and constantly repeated. For captions I often use in or loop animations. For the first caption I add zoom out animation, which adds dynamics at the beginning of the video. For this caption we add the shake effect using the loop animation jiggle. Try adding different animations, find what you like and use them. Now let's make separate highlighting for each word in the caption. Click on the required caption, turn on the video, equals. When the first word is spoken in the video, pause it and divide the caption using the split function. Do this after each word. Now select one part and highlight the first word. Change the color to yellow and increase the size by 4 points. Repeat with the other words. And here is what we got. M equals money. You can do this with a few more captions in the video. To add more visualization to the video, I will add images to the captions. Let's take the basic stickers available in CapCut. Drag it onto the timeline, resize it to the size of the caption, set it to the desired position. I also add a loop animation jump to highlight the sticker on the screen. In CapCut you can also add your own cards or emojis. I downloaded an emoji from the website emojipedia.org. Drag it onto the timeline, place it on the screen and add animation. Everything is quickly and easy. I'll add some more graphics to the captions. What's missing? Sound effects. Sounds are an important part of such captions. You can use sounds from the CapCut collection or add your own. You can use the search to find what you need. Download the sound and drag it onto the timeline. At this point I add a swoosh effect. I set it at the beginning of the animation. I make the sound quieter. Here's what we get as a result. It's cap cut. For this emoji I want to download my own sound, add it to the timeline, also reduce the volume, work on the sounds throughout the video and click export. On computer you can also make such beautiful captions with cap cut. Of course it will take your time and as we know 
time equals money. So if you need, you can always order this service from freelancers. That's all, the cool captions for the video are ready. If this video was useful for you, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel and watch this video.